lives behind bars less than a year after being sentenced to life in prison. Now the victim's family is speaking out to our Brett Rains. It's new at 6. This is 62-year-old Raymond Larry Nichols. He was convicted last year for killing his former brother-in-law, Joe Neff. Nichols only served a few months of his life sentence before dying from lung cancer. It's unfortunate that he didn't spend more time in prison, and I know that offends people that, you know, I shouldn't feel that way, but it's been a long, hard road, and my dad didn't deserve what he got. In 2009, investigators found a bloody crime scene inside Neff's LaFleur County bar. His body was discovered miles away, dumped in a pond. Investigators say he was shot to death. And I miss him so much, and he was taken so early. You know, he could have had so many more years with us and the grandkids, and that's, that is what is so hard. Marie Pitchford waited five years to see justice for her father. She's always believed her uncle wasn't the only one responsible for his murder. Now she may never know if anyone else was involved. What he knew, he took to the grave with him, unless he's told somebody that hasn't forwarded the messages on to me. I know he didn't do it alone. Everybody knows he didn't do it alone. At least he died behind bars. Brett Rains, 4029 News. Investigators tell us there was no evidence that linked anyone else to Neff's murder. They say unless there's new information, they consider the case closed.